Hey everyone, I hope you all are safe and doing good. So I know many of you students are in final year and you must be busy in now placements. But those who are in third year and second year, they are, uh, you know, uh, searching for some internships. Although the season, like in summer, you get internship in May, June and July. So if you want to uh, do an internship in some, you know, reputed institute or some companies, like maybe uh, some great companies or uh, the institute like IITs, NITs and this thing. So the process already starts from January itself. And I hope you have done all these things and you got internship. I mean, you will be having your internship in May, June and July. But this video is for those who are still confused and still don't get any internship. So yeah, still now you have also have a chance to get internship, to do internship at NITs. I'll tell you in this video, there are uh, still two NITs uh, there you can go and uh, do your internship. Right. But before, I just want to tell you one thing as your summer vacation is now coming so it's better to upskill yourself yourself everybody will work on you know uh, they self like maybe learning any new skill or something like this so if you are interested to learn any programming language like java because java is like still it's top three programming languages among the top three programming languages so you can go for this now maybe you are thinking from where you can go for uh, the scores and all from where you can get right resources so uh, no more uh, wasting hours for searching the right course or right resources I have got you covered because I have recently started my Java from scratch course from 28th of March. And there we will be covering from beginning from the scratch basics of Java like core Java, then oops, multi-threading, database connectivity, sockets, and till project we will be discussing everything. So if you don't know anything about coding, ABCD of coding, you can still go for this course because everything I'm going to cover in this course. And the course duration would be five to six months because we'll, because we'll be covering everything in detail. So I'll be not like that. I'll cover Java in one month or two months. No, don't expect this. It's not a crash course. I'll be covering everything in a detailed manner. No. So it will take uh, five or to six months almost. Right. Classes would be every uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And plus now you if you get stuck somewhere. So it's okay. Weekly, we will have a live Q&A session as well. Live doubt resolution session. There, you can ask for doubts and I'm here to answer your doubts. Plus, if you are still confused, then there is one more uh, way you can ask your doubts. WhatsApp group. Yes, you will get access to a dedicated WhatsApp group. There you can enroll after. I mean, you can join after enrolling in this course in that WhatsApp group. And I'm just like one message away from you. You can ask your doubts there also. And you can interact with the other students who are in this course. So this course will basically take you from beginning to to all the way to like uh, solving lead code questions as well as building projects and plus this is for java but you are interested in java plus dsa then there is one more course java plus dsa there will be covering like first not this complete java but yes java and then dsa so this uh, course has already been started but i'm still accepting the enrollments enrollments are going to be closed soon for this course DSA with Java, mastering DSA with Java. So here, Java plus you will get complete DSA from basic to advanced. Same. Here also live Q&A session plus uh, you will get a dedicated WhatsApp group, access to dedicated WhatsApp, WhatsApp group. So if you are interested, you can go for this. Here you get a special offer in on Java, DSA with Java. Gift 15, you can get extra 15% discount. And if you want to go for that Java from scratch course, so right now there is early bird discount going on you can apply i have directly slashed the prices half right now plus extra 10 percent discount if you use the code java 10 you will get extra 10 percent discount here in java from scratch so don't worry the link of both the courses you will get in the description box of this video you can go and check out now let me show you where the nit is the internship at nit so one is at nit warangal the opening is the last date to apply for this is link you will get for these internships also uh, in the description box of this video don't worry last date to apply for this is 11 march but apply as soon as possible right don't wait for the last date duration of this would be from may 9 to 11th of july and uh, anybody can apply those who are in btech or doing an integrated degree btech plus mtech or MSc or integrated MSc and MBA students can also apply for this, right? Now, okay, one thing is uh, here, in this case, you will not get any scholarship kind of thing, right? So it's not paid, you'll not get anything. 
but yeah you can access you can get access to their labs library facilities internet facility facilities and free hostel accommodation you will get but the thing is this free hostel accommodation this is on first come first so basis and uh, in th these departments the internship is available so if you are computer science students you can apply other than that if you are chemi chemical civil mechanical mathematics or management studies or, or many more things in all the departments internships are available so you can apply right eligibility is you should be free in that time period from 9th may to i guess 11th of july and any be btech bsc bsc bed student with a good academic record who has appeared in in at least 6th semester examination 6th semester examination can apply and you need all your grade sheets from the previous semesters this is the requirement msc mba students can also apply for this who appeared in at least second semester examination right so you can go and apply and if you have any doubt you can mail intern at internship to 2025 at the rate nitw.ac.in here and uh, yeah if you if you need anything like if you uh, need support for this thing see the mail is also given here over here support for filling the application form you can uh, write down here if you are facing any difficulty right second is at nit surat there also uh, the last date of application is 11th of april 11th of april so now here total intern they need 50 intern and in this case you will get you know, that fellowship it's a paid internship you will get 5000 per month and the duration is 19th may to 18th of july hostel accommodation is there but but with payment basis it's not free in this case in the previous case it was free and uh, who can apply any student pursuing b b tech with a good academic record, record who has appeared in at least fifth semester examination those who can apply means you are in like third year you can apply now any integrated msc integrated m tech dual degree student with good academic record who has appeared at least fifth semester examination can also apply and uh, obviously your gpa should be like a little bit really good to apply here and you have to submit in this case a project write up also on which project you are working where have you work and what kind of output and you get so in in 500 words you have to write down that write up also a synopsis kind of thing of that project and you have to submit because on your academic record and on your project idea like yeah they want to see that you have a clear idea a clear idea idea that you are working on this project and this is how you are working which you are using what output you will get at the last what you want to achieve and all if you are very clear with that thing in the project if you specify that thing you will be having high chances of getting selected right now pass out students cannot apply students who are in final year of the above mentioned degree are not eligible to apply so if you are pass out or final year student you cannot apply for this selection process is first whatever you submit that your documents and the project and all according to that you will be selected and then interview would be there accordingly you will be selected and selected candidates will be in, uh, informed through the email only so you can go and check out here also you can scan this and you can uh, for a, on google form also you can apply or you can directly just click on this link and you can just uh, fill this there you have to first uh, log in let me just show you so once you log in you will be getting this kind of page here you have to submit your detail name your admission number name of the parent institute from where you are like doing your btech or whatever degree you are pursuing then a bona fide certificate also it's a private or government institute or inter internship applied to which department you have to select that thing cgpa and upload all the sem semester marks the mark sheet as well as you have to upload the project write up and then submit it's a so the link you will get in the description box of this video for these internship as well as don't forget to check out my java course and dsa with java course on my website the link of these courses also you will get in the description box of this video right so now that's it for this video now i'll see you in the next video till then bye bye take care